the smartest investors, they are able to act rationally even when the markets are crashing and everybody's in a panic. They are able to also act really, really fast when everybody else is relaxing in the calm before the storm. They have a great setup for how to overview everything and know what to dive down deep on. And they bring unique knowledge to the market. They don't just know the same things that everybody else knows. But they've really found something where they have superior knowledge. I wake up in the morning, I eat a green apple and drink my coffee. Then I get an overview of what's happened in the financial markets and how my stocks are doing. Then I start my core research, deep diving on individual companies getting an understanding of what their management teams are like, what their strategies are like, what are their products and services, how are their financial statements, what are their opportunities in the future. And I value these companies and invest in the ones that are worth a lot more than they cost. I always rank all of these companies from the best to the worst and ensure that I'm invested in the ones that are the most attractive. So the tools that I use to invest are some of the very expensive data subscriptions that feed automatically into my financial models that I've been building on for 10 years. I gather data from more than 2,000 companies automatically and complement that with a lot of subjective insights to constantly rank all of these companies and have a picture of which are the most attractive ones to be invested in. I also use the risk chart from eToro to see how much different assets in my portfolio are contributing to my risk. And that's just one great way of ensuring that I can reduce my risk. So how do I decide on which instruments to invest in? Two words, fundamental analysis. So I conduct deep dives in the company, looking at all of the available information, and then I value those companies, how much are they worth compared to their price, and I invest in companies that I evaluate are much more valuable than their price would indicate. So what makes eToro great for beginners and advanced investors is that it's the largest, most user-friendly platform. For beginners, it's really great that you can just download the app and create a demo account and learn to use it. For instance, see what it's like to click the buy button before committing any real funds. For people that use the app every day like myself and other advanced users, it's really great that it's user friendly in this way, but also that it, for instance, has 0% commission on stocks. I feel a great sense of responsibility and motivation from the more than 20,000 copiers that copy my portfolio. Also, a lot of my friends and family members copy me and they're always sure to let me know if uh, they're not happy with anything. Being able to, you know, invest my own money in the best way I can and then having this amplified effect from it really makes it feel worthwhile to pour my everything into my research and my work on this. So if I could give one tip to new investors, it would be to download the eToro app and create a free demo account. Then you can learn what it's like to use an investment platform, see what it's like to click the buy button. And then after that, you will have a good understanding if it's for you. And that's really the fastest way to learn.